Okay, another thing that uh, Oxyprops add to your editor is direct access to the framework. So when I start building something, I insert a section and inside of my section, I want a heading and a text. And now I want to style my section and I want to give it padding, for example. So here, the idea behind uh, Oxyprops is that for each and every input field you will find in your editor, I want to make your life easier and offer suggestions for inputs. And this is done with context menus or context panels available for every single input field. So for example, if I want to add top padding, I can right click the field and this context menu opens offering me a choice of options relevant for a padding field. Padding field is a CSS dimension field. So we get dimensions. And as you saw, when I hover the various values, I have a direct preview of the result. So if I apply a size 10 to my padding top, this result in this padding, which is a var size 10. I'll do the same for the bottom padding. And now let's say that I want to apply a background color. I can right click my color picker and I get a different context menu because this one is relevant for a color input field. And we will see later in details the various colors. But you can see that I have the colors, the surface one I told you, which is the default for the background. And then I have other surfaces. And once again, I have a direct preview of the resulting color. So let's pick surface three, for example. And if I want to modify my heading size, I will go to typography, font size, right click. And again, I have a different context menu because this one is relevant for font size fields and it offers me the various options for a font size. So let's say that I want the font size fluid six. And the same will apply for line height with a specific context menu for light line height. Say that I want a reduced one and for letter spacing. Okay, so that's the ID. Oxyprops includes a CSS framework with CSS variables available for you and to make things easier in the editor. In each single input field, you get a context menu that suggests variables relevant for that field.